Ho ho ho! And welcome everyone to the next video game walkthrough on my YouTube channel. After doing Freyfish 2, The Case of the Haunted Schoolhouse, here is number 3, The Case of the Stolen Conch Shell. Let's get started with this walkthrough. Here's the opening intro for this game. How are you enjoying the flight on Pelican Sam Airlines, Freddy? A lot, Sam. Gosh, Luther, it was really great of your Uncle Blenny to invite us to the Founders Day Festival. Well, Uncle Blenny says that I'm his favorite nephew. And you know I'd never take a special trip like this without my best friend, Freddy Fit. And me too, Map Superstar. And here's a tell card for this game. Talk about crash landing too. Thanks for the lift, Sam. Have a good time. Now here you can move the cursor to Pelican Sam and to speak to him if you want. <clears throat> you can also click on this book here. There will be visitors from around the world at the Founders Day Festival. That foreign language phrase book could really come in handy. Right as rain, Freddy, it's all yours. As soon as you give me one R and C urchin, that is. Yeah. Head down this way, into the water. And here's one purple sea urchin right here. Hey Luther, what word do the letters U-R-C-H-I-N spell? A pop quiz? Can't think! Brain failing! Ah! It spells urchin. You're so silly. They spell urchin, as in, we found a purple sea urchin. <clears throat> exactly. Next, you want to pull this plug here to open this gate. Hmm, I wonder what will happen if I pull this plug. It opens the gate. Open sesame. Great job. I knew you could pull it off. Get it? Pull off? Oh, Luther. Now you notice inside the clam here is the, one of the golden pipes, but I can't get to it at the moment. Here's what happens when you start to move the cursor to the one of the golden pipes here. That looks like something expensive! Careful! Yikes! I almost lost a pin! I'm not trying that again! Not without something to keep that clam from snapping shut! Exactly. Now for this game here, you'll never know where the, the, the golden pipes are hidden. So just have to go around the ocean floor and to find these golden pipes and to figure out how to <clears throat> how to get all three of them. Head this way here. And speaking of Uncle Bunny, take a look at where he is. In jail. Luther! Freddy! Over here! Uncle Bunny? Here's what's going on. Uncle Blenny, what are you doing in jail? Well, Luther, the great conch shell was stolen. The Founders Day Festival can't start without it. Since I'm the grand exalted keeper of the conch, I'm the prime suspect. But I didn't do it. Here, here's a diagram of the conch shell before it was taken. The priceless conch had three golden pipes, but they may have fallen out. And here's a picture of all the people who were nearby when the crime happened. There's Gil Barker, Claw, Nadine the Narwhal, Rosie Pearl, Pierre the Tailor, and Horst Fetters the Tourist. The culprits. Can't your dogfish sniff out the thief? Old Soggy Sniffer ain't what it used to be. <laughs> but if he can get the three golden pipes, he can pick up the scent. We'll find the three golden pipes, Uncle Blenny. You're my only hope, nephew. You and your friend, Freddy Fish. And don't worry, I'm here to help too. Now for that golden pipe they saw back there, 
that was inside the clam, you basically need a shim, sham, jim, me, jam, clapper, gapper to, to, to keep that um, clam from staying open. I'll show you where you, gotta, where you gotta go and get it. Now, here on the screen here on the computer, you can click on it. You can um, move the paintbrush here to different colors and to change different colors of what you see right here on Benny's computer. You can like add different hats, wigs, eyes, mouth, different accessories here. You can also um, move the cursor here and to change the different letters here. But I'm not gonna waste time doing this right now because I have um I'm on a mission right now. Let's go and find those three golden pipes. Now, speaking of those culprits, if you're wondering where to go to find those culprits, I'll show you. Like over here is basically where you meet Pierre the Tailor, the needlefish. You can click on this guy and speak to him. Excuse me, sir, but are you a tailor? Not just a tailor. I am Pierre the tailor. When Pierre men sing so better than new. So if something was torn into a million billion teensy little pieces, could you mend it together? Be sure. With my eyes closed, floating on my head, and with both fins tied behind my back. Exactly. He's the needlefish. You can also, now, now you notice this blue feather right here, you want to move <coughs> the cursor to it, this will also come in handy too. Sometimes you'll, you never know what there is here in the, um, in Pierre's place. I thought that blue feather might come in handy, but not for the version that I'm playing right now. Now, every once in a while, you can like look at them, you can go to the folder here, and to see the different culprits. If we're going to save the Founders Day Festival, we've got to find all the golden pipes, so old Soggy can help us catch the thief. Also, you can like look inside the folder every once in a while, and to keep track of the golden pipes that you found throughout the game. I'm gonna exit out of here right now and get back to the game in the meantime. Now over here is basically where you meet the, the other two characters, Gil Barker, the shark, and Nadine the narwhal, when you head down this way. And here's Gil Barker right now. Step right up, gills and buoys, for the most amazing carnival under the sea. You remember the terrific tumble tubes ride last year? Well, what we've got in store for you this year is even better. Exactly. Now you, know, you can go inside here, but you need, you're going to need the sea urchins, the purple sea urchins, to get in here. Looking for fun? Got four purple sea urchins just burning a hole in your pocket. Then step right up to Gil Barker's fantastic floating fun. You can have more fun than a barrel of brine shrimp. Just pay, then play. Hey, hey, what do you say? I just flew in on a manta ray. Yeah, and since I don't have the four pur purple sea urchins at the moment, I gotta go and find uh, three more. I got one of them, but I gotta find three more. Head down this way here. Here's Nadine the Narwhal, and today is not her lucky day because she's got um, a, one of the bolts stuck on her narwhal tooth. You can click on her to speak to her. Gee, what's the matter? It's this thing stuck on my tooth. Only 1% of lady narwhals grow a tooth, you know. But now it's ruined, defaced by this metal nut. How'd that nut get stuck on there? More to the point, how will I ever get it off? Come on, Luther. Let's lend a spin. It's not gonna work. <gasps> it's stuck. Oh dear. My beautiful tooth. Don't worry. We'll find a way to remove that nut. <clears throat> Click on the shovel here. This will come handy too. Look, Luther. A plastic shovel. We could use it to dig a hole all the way to the other side of the world. Whatever you say, Luther. 
it'll take a long time to dig the china. Now basically we need the pliers to get the, the bolt off the Nadine's narwhal tooth. And I'll show you where to find it, don't worry. But I'm gonna end this part of the walkthrough right now. I'll continue on with more, continue on with more of this game next part. I haven't found the, the orange sea urchin. But it, it turns out they need that Frey and Luther are given one orange sea urchin when they return the wall they found to its owner. What will they spend it on? But I'm going to end this part of the walkthrough in the meantime. I'll continue on with more of this game in the next part. I'll see you then. Bye.